Welcome back. Unfortunately, the uh, Vintage Cube is no longer around. So Mike and I are going to do our first Rivals of Ixalan draft. It's my first Rivals draft ever. And uh, like I said before we started recording, if I if we end up losing, I blame Mike. That's this pack good. actually seems good. Like, you have this guy, which is a real cutie. I don't want him to die, though. I, oh, you saw that, did you? Yeah. <laughs> and then you got this guy, 3-3, three, three, whenever you... He doesn't untap, but whenever you gain life, he does untap. You have this guy, which just gives uh, plus one, plus one, as long as... Well, it gives you plus one, plus one for your your creature type, so vampires, whoever. And if you have... So you have vigilance? Yeah. Not bad. I think this guy's the dude, though. 4-4 four, for four, four, and whenever it attacks, it deals a damage to a creature or player. That dude is huge. It's not bad. And, like, you get to either target your enraged guys or pick off smaller opponent guys. Impale is also very good. Destroy a creature for just four mana, so pretty simple like i mean it's just worse than murder but it's still very very good it's murder it's murder i'm gonna just take this raging reggie raging reggie that's old reg hunt the week that's a good one that's a classic oh, look at that art yeah it's actually great they got the... that boy <laughs> it's a jade bear which is a one one and when there's battlefield you put a one one on another merfolk you control so it has to be merfolk though yeah Pirates Pillage, as an additional cost, discard a card, draw two cards, and then create two tokens. So this is just basically Torrenting Voices, uh, except it makes two two treasures and it costs you two more. Still pretty good. Drawing two is not not the bait. Yeah, four mana. And then see, this guy is just a 3-4 for four. This is the, the Grazing Whiptail, is that what it's called? And um, Except it doesn't have reach. So, so I got a sick Mohawk. Crown is when it enters the battlefield is one damage to enchanted creature. So you can either ping your own guy or put it on an enemy's guy and kill it. And plus three plus oh and trample is pretty good. Like this seven four trample. That doesn't seem bad. Target creature gets plus one plus one gains first strike. Target pirate gets plus one plus one against double strike. I'm gonna go with Hunt the Week here because I think it's the strongest card. I heard there's a bug on Magic Online where it doesn't take the card you you reserve. So I'm gonna try to avoid that, but I don't like having to do so. Yeah, it's dumb. Uh, Search for a dinosaur egg. Yeah, how'd you know? Is this one of the few cards I saw? Uh, yeah, it's it's the search for a dinosaur you put it on top, and then whenever a dinosaur enters a battlefield, you may have it. This card deal one damage to each creature, which is actually pretty good. Pretty good, especially with all the en enrage guys. I think it might be this guy, even though we're loading up on four drops now. Sometimes you got to play a lot of four drops. You're not wrong. This is just a three three four four that makes a treasure, I guess. This is a 4-4. Four, four. That's what it does. Okay. <laughs> no guessing needed. That's what it does. Hey, Steve, you have another dino? What up, version? Leovold. Good seeing you, buddy. Fenodroid. Um, what are we taking? This guy, right? Yeah. I think so. And this is has haste as long as you control another dino? Sure. I'm going to... Yeah, I'm just going to take it, I guess. Uh. This card is also amazing, but again, it's another four drop. It is whenever it attacks another dinosaur, it gets flying until the end of the turn. So, it's pretty good. This guy attacks each or blocks each combat fable. It's just a three, three for two. I don't want to go into another color, but we kind of have to now because these are the all three of these. We have shatter and naturalize, which are just not great. They're both in the set. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and you have a. Uh, you have Jade, thing, yeah. yeah. So I'm like, it's like, I guess we're just taking one of these. I guess we just take the other four, the third, the fourth four drop in our. Only four drops. That's what we do. Mono four drops. Thought set right now. No storm the vault. Another four drop, eh? Yeah, but I mean, like, it's. I'm just. I wonder if. I wonder. Wonder which of these cards are actually worth money. I four damage storm to a creature. That's anything. actually pretty good. What? What did you say? I doubt storm the vault's worth anything. Wow, that's real sad. I guess you're right. Wow, Kamina's 22 tickets. That's insane. Jeez. Quite a drop-off, though, after that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Even the Planeswalkers are worth nothing. Um, They're worth the three. Uh, yeah, I think it's just Bombard here. It's it's pretty pretty simple pick it's also not a four drop so we got that going yeah nice us. nice perks oh another four drop 
Target creatures you control explorers. That's pretty boring. Dinosaur spells you cast cost two less to cast. Uh, that is a two four for, for four. You get to play an extra land that turn, though. Right through the unknown. Oh, yeah, interesting. That is a, a relevant line of text. Uh, whenever this guy is dealt damage, create a 1 1. That's Not actually bad. Yeah, that's actually probably the pick. I think that guy's pretty good. I'd love to get this guy, but like the next turn you have five mana, and like there's only like two dinosaurs that actually get discounted by this guy. I have not seen the Tavern Brawl. I will probably check it out. I'm gonna take the Armor Sword. I think that guy's the best, right? Yeah. Oh, another Bombard? That seems good. And then we have a 2 1 with Menace or just a 2 2 for 3. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the 4 damage. Seems good. I think, oh, that's actually great for us. Yeah, that seems better than Traveler's Amulet. <gasps> Little Cutie came back! Little cute. Cutie! It's a good boy. It is a good boy. So uh, when he dies, what happens again? You get a... So when he dies, you can cast dinosaur spells as though they had flash. So if it dies during your opponent's turn, you can play a dinosaur. And then uh, the next dinosaur, whenever you cast the dinosaur that turn, when it dies, uh, it, it gets fights. to fight a dude when it comes into play. It's not the bait. Um, I guess it's crown. I don't think we need more dinosaurs or more four drops. And I kind of like the... Uh, Dreadmaw is really good, I guess. I mean, all right, sure. Oh, all right, so infinite dinosaurs here. Oh, well, <laughs> okay, cool. Guess two knights of the stampede. The Tavern Brawl is World Championship decks from 2014, 2015, and 2016 unnerfed. That seems insane. This is a lot of dinosaurs, just so you guys know. That guy searches for dinosaurs, too? That's pretty good. What do we got here? So, dinosaur, 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 dinosaur. This is already seven dinosaurs. Seven saurs. And then three other cards that interact with dinosaurs. Oof. And this card's not even terrible. Ooh, that's a good dude, right? So, 5-5, five, five, you can play an additional land on each of your turns, and it can't attack or block unless you have the City's Blessing, which is 10 permanents. But, it does let you play additional land. And it's still a 5-5. Five, five. Like, as soon as you get a send, like, just a 5-5. Five, five. Which I think it's just... I mean, there's not really many cards competing for it right now. Like... No. What does this guy do? 2-5 flying, if it has vigilance, if you got another dinosaur? Yeah, this guy's just better. Forerunner is insane with Hatchling. Um, oh my god! Oh my god! We're totally ta totally taking that dude. Yeah, that's that's insane. Big boy. Yeah, I was trying to read. Someone said that Recycled Toad said Forerunner is insane with Hatchling. I'm trying to figure. I wipe my opponent's board with it. How'd you wipe their board with it? That's what I'm wondering. Whenever a dinosaur on the battlefield, you may have Forerunner deal one damage to each creature. So you play this guy, it deals one damage to each creature. I guess you flash. Oh, you flash in another guy. It deals one damage to each creature again. And then you can fight something. So you're dealing two damage to each creature and then you fight something. So I guess it's just yeah. a good amount of damage. Which makes sense. We got Mausoleum Harpy, which is a 3-3. Whenever a creature dies, you can put a plus one, plus one counter on it. If you have the City's Blessing, sure. Mm. Yeah. Well, Raptor, Hatch Raptor, Raptor Hatchling only makes one, one dinosaur because he dies immediately. So that, that would be weird. None of these cards are like, this is literally just a dead pack for us except for like it's this guy. Bad. Target creature and opponent controls deal damage equal to its power to another creature that player controls. Raptor Hatchling, interesting. So you, it comes into play, it dies, you make a 3-3. Three, three. You shoot it. You shoot everything again. I guess, I, mean, I guess that works the same way, right? It's both two dinosaurs coming into play and one fight. Yeah, we'll just take this guy. It's a merfolk, but 
Still a two one that can't be blocked, so whatever. Wow, with a double way wayward sore tooth deck. Woo. Their teeth are gonna be so sore. <laughs> sore tooth. Wow, that's pretty good. Zagon, what's going on? I heart you too, buddy. Much loaf. I'm going to take the double sword tooth. In the case you did not know. Release to the wind. Exile and only impermanent. And then it just get to, get to replay it. Yeah, it's weird. None of these cards are... I like this card. I like this card a lot, actually. But there's a lot of blue cards in these packs. Too bad blue sucks. <laughs> oh, there's nothing. I guess take the strider harness, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I'll take do. the rare. Whatever. Uh, it's just plus one, plus one in haste. Great. Look, this dinosaur's got robot legs on. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna take the rare. I could care less. Oh, if only you were a different. I guess there's no other land we can get because they're these are all off color. I thought this guy was consoling his dead friend, but it turns out he's just eating that, eating him after he killed it. Hmm. We're only splashing white, I guess, for like. Reasonable stuff. Pretty good stuff. I guess we take this guy. Sure. <laughs> oh, we don't actually have one of these, so I guess that's fine. Four damage to target a creature you don't control and two to a creature you do. Oh, maybe it's actually Reckless Rage. I like that a lot. Yeah, that seems real good. It's a lot of damage for one mana. I mean, it gets to trigger one of your enrages, so that's pretty cool. Yep, another. Oh, another Hunt the Week? All right, sure. Deals one damage to each creature without flying. Draw a card. I feel like that could be good. Shake, shake, shake. Shake the foundation. <laughs> That's pretty good. Evolving Wilds? That seems good. Yeah, agreed. This is just tap it to... It's a three mana mana rock and sack it to gain three life and draw a card if you, if you, if you control the city's blessing. So, not bad. I'd rather evolve though. I'm going to take the naturalize just to have one. I'm going to take this... this gr uh. Gryffindor? <laughs> Four points to Gryffindor? Uh, if you have the City's Blessing, put one encounter on it. That's pretty good. That's actually... This card's insane. I'll just play this guy. I'll splash it blue. Huh. Look, I got the Strider Harness anyway. Oh, great. It's like it was meant to be. I'm just going to take all the uncommons. Oh, even this guy's a little cutie. Probably not making the cut, but he's a little cutie. This deck seems pretty good. Well, we might decide in Shatter, but we already have Naturalize, so I didn't feel like we'd decide in Shatter and Naturalize. So. What if they got Jit? Well, then I guess I'm... Oh, well, jeez. Do we just draft all these, like, seven and eight mana white cards? I don't know. What about Stormfleet and Pyromancer? Isn't that guy good? Not really. Very deals to you. I do like uh, Territorial Hammer Skull here, but I'm I'm reluctant to add more white to our deck. But I don't think... Yeah, he just steals two, and if you have to raid, I don't know. This guy's like just better. Pirate Wizard. That is that is a lot of, uh, a lot of occupations. He's got a lot of jobs, yeah. Yeah. That, <laughs> he really wears a lot of hats around the pirate ship, I guess. And you can tell he's wearing one right now. Around my pirate ship. I'm just going to take yeah, the turret. wearing a hat. Yeah, he is. They both got hats on. Oh, he's lighting a guy on fire that's wearing a hat. No, he's... they both have hats. That ain't no hat, man. That's like a do-rag. Okay, it might be a do-rag, actually. <laughs> that's like a do-rag. God, jeez. Oh, good lord, Mitchell. All right, when this attacks, exile at the end of combat, then return to the battlefield transformed. Tap it to add a mana. Tap it in two to draw a card and discard. Four to draw a card. Six to return a card from your graveyard to your hand. This card seems great. But the funny thing is I also really like Savage Stomp and I also like Sentinel Totem. He just named Dinosaur. Oh no, this is the other one. This is not the mana one. Okay, that guy that card sucks then, so it's only one of these two. How it's good is Conqueror's tough. Galleon? What did you say? It's pretty tough. What is? The pick? The pick, yeah. I agree. We already have two Hunt the Weeks though. Yeah, Savage Stomp is pretty insane. Blue Templar TV, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. You think it's Stomp over 
Conqueror's Galleon? I mean, it normally costs one green. It's pretty broken. And we have two five fives. Yeah. Galleon actually might be too slow. I can agree with that. All right, we'll take the stomp here. Whoa, that's great Stompin', for us. Stomping dinosaurs. This card might be broken in our deck because we have uh, Shake the Foundations, Forerunner of the Empire. I don't know if we're even playing Shake, though. Yeah, you might be right. I can I can see cutting it. Uh, I think this is probably better just because of our mana. It lets us play a few more. Or Pillar, actually. Pillar is also really good. That's the one where you name Dinosaur. So it's either this, this, or this. I don't know which one, though. I like Blind. I do, too, actually. Plus, it's got a little dinosaur on it. That's probably a sizable dinosaur based on this. Uh... Oh, man, it's a little. Okay. My bad. I think our entire deck is dinosaurs, which is pretty good. I guess we have two humans here. But they help dinosaurs, so they're kind of dinosaurs. They do. Kind of swords, if you will. Nice. Oh, we have uh, two humans and one merfolk and 11 dinosaurs. That's a lot of dinosaurs. Man, I wish we could take this. It's a lot of romping and a lot of stomping. And a, Yeah, you're not wrong. Might just be New Horizons. New Harambes. New Harambes. Is that not right? Is that not what it's called? This pack is kind of mediocre. This is real middle of the road. We got Aerosaur, which is 3-4 Fly, which is fine. New Horizons, which is reasonable when we want to fix our colors and kind of ramp to these two guys. Thrash is a 5-3 pretty consistently, I would imagine, but we don't really want another 4-drop. He's thrashing, he's rashing, he's mashing. Job and I, mate. <laughs> that was good. I like that little throwback you did there. Job and I, mate. So I think it's actually one of these two. I don't know which one, though. I think New Horizons is better. To fix his mana. Alright, I took it. I don't know if I loved it, but I took it. I didn't love it. Mm, yeah, but I had to take it. This is just a 3-2 that gains you 4 life, which is not terrible. It's okay. It's okay. Not, not great. Not great. Not great. Not eh, reasonable. This is reasonable because it doesn't require you to have like a vampire or something. It's just a 3-2 that makes a 1-1 life linker. True. And we have Pterodon Knight, which has flying as long as you control a dinosaur. So probably always going to have flying. So... 3-3 three, three Flyers probably work. Ooh, we can name Dinosaur. This is actually really good for us. It's not bad. It's just Cavern of Souls, right? Not quite. It's basically the same thing. No, it's not. It's basically Cavern of Souls. I'll just take this guy. This guy's actually fine. Not great, but I think it's better than uh, the one less guy. It's better than the New Horizons. Number two. Trove is not really an option. It's kind of meh. I don't know if I'm underrating this guy, but I really don't want to have white a white on turn one anyway, so. Oh, slice in twain? Mm. When this enters the battlefield, start opponent loses one life and you gain one life. You just add a oh, man, boy. Mana rocks nowadays have gone downhill significantly, yeah, they all cost dude. Mana. They're all terrible. We don't have the problem with the problem with our uh, our enrage strategy now is that we don't actually have that many enrage guys. I'm just gonna take. Do you even have any enrage guys? Mm, one. We have frilled death spitter, which deals two to each opponent. Wow, this guy just came right on back. I'll take him. I don't think we're gonna play him because, good lord, he costs a million. That big old one seven. That is a big old one seven. I think we just take that three three vigilance that becomes a, that explores. Yeah, that guy's pretty good. I would love it if the ooh destroy a that's a good that's a good removal spell. I would love it if the totem came back, but it's not looking good. I think we play that removal spell. Well, this is ooh nest robber, not terrible. Seventeen creatures, and we gotta make one cut as it is. It's probably a creature then. Sometimes you get real close to the mic and it looks real weird. I used to love her. Ooh, yeah. 
what is this? What did you say? Did you sing a song that sounds like this? No. Did, you didn't do some Guns N' Roses like some Guns N' Roses meme. I'm gonna cut this I don't guy. Think so. Is it this guy? Yeah, that guy's not great. You can cut them both. Oh, I cut. I cut one already. Why not the other one? Well, I did. That was the one I did. I already cut one, and then that was the other one. Tell me again. Oh, God, I hate you so much. Tell me again. You should play that judgment card. Say it slower. Uh, destroy creature power four greater. My problem with that is, mm-hmm. um, one of our like, I guess it could be fine. You can't cast that off unclaimed territory though. Yeah, I don't like the raptor. Which one? The red white on two. Like we're never casting that guy. Three three. We got we got at least four ways to get produce white, and we also have still doesn't seem great. Really, it's got vigilance. For a two drop. It's a three three. Would I play this if it was a four drop though? A three three for four with vigilance, probably. Really? Why wouldn't I? So it just goes. All right. So let's say it's three. Like even if you play it on three, it's still a good value. You're see. I think you're falling into the trap where like if you can't cast it on two, you don't like it. But it's right. still a great rate on three. And on four, it's still just average. It's still just the same as like a three, three for four. Look, there you go. That's you right there. Hundred percent you. Yes. No, you still. You sure you didn't sing this song, dude? I don't even know what you're singing. It's the Guns N' Roses song. Go on. No, you still love her. Ooh, yeah, but I had to kill her. I'm not familiar with that song. Okay, well then, yeah, that's definitely a no, but I'm uncomfortable with it. Do we want Stormfleet Pyromancer? No, we want the, let's we'll put the Judgment in, I guess, over the Pyromancer. Sure. Look at all that green. That's a lot of green. A lot of gren. So this would be three, four, five, six sources of red. I don't have any double reds, and most of these can be cast off on claim territory, which gives us seven. Six, seven, eight sources of green. Seems fine. Nine with the unclaimed territory also seems fine. Four, five, six sources of white. We can maybe cut a white. Yeah, I don't like that. I just like it like as is. All right. All right. I'm okay with it. Yeah, this deck looks powerful. We got a lot of rares at least. Well, three, I guess. Oh, there's clearly four there. Okay, you're right. I had to put her six feet under, and I can still hear her complain. Wow. It's a Guns N' Roses song. You're a Guns N' Roses song? I know. <laughs> Is that Cheddar Pile Boy? Yeah, I'd pause with that. I can just leave it on your desk forever to look baller. I don't feel comfortable with that, though. Why not? Someone's gonna come in here and snatch it. It'll be me. Well, then I. Well, at least I know now. I ain't giving it back either. Hey, Mike, may you see that money I have on my desk? No, no, me no see it. Hey, man, let's check out that stream that we did that one time. <laughs> you know where you confessed that it'd be you. I have no idea what you're talking about. That was deleted off the internet. <laughs> hey, man, Mike, you you see anybody use my computer and delete my videos off the internet? Uh, no, sir. All right, well, this is all. Why are you sh- doing this weird voice? I don't understand. Is that you saying that or me saying that? That's you saying that. I didn't say that, though. I got these new ones. They're like peach lemonade, and they have a real weird smell to them. It smells almost like poison. Oh, that is louder than... It does smell a little odd. It's got a weird smell to it, right? I don't know if I'd say it smells like poison. Well, maybe you've never had poison before. You know I have it. Maybe you're not as f- familiar as working in the poison mills as I am. <laughs> the poison mills, huh? Well, Seems that's dangerous. That's where we're, yeah, well, that, why do you think I got out of that game? That was that was a different lifetime, Michael. Just kind of smells like candy. It smells like some kind of way is what it smells like. Some type of way. Uh, I'm going to ship you cuz I don't need you. I don't need you. Yeah, there you go. And I can still hear Mike complain. 
I had to send my watch out to get to get the bracelet, the band fixed, and now it's like fixed. Cool that's story, my bro. <laughs> that's my story. Yeah, that's that the might have been the best story I've ever heard. Yeah, I feel like there were a lot of twists and turns. Oh yeah. Did it get fixed? Tell us more. This is an intense game going on here. This would never happen in Vintage Q. Both players are like, third land, go. Alright, you played a 1 1. Alright, that seems fine. Oh, give me a land so I can. So I can hunt these two dudes. <laughs> cool story, bro. <bro.jpg>. JPEG. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. How are they called true lime yet they produce flavors that aren't lime based? I don't well that, there's true lemon. One of them's true lemon. Oh look, we got a land, guys. Whenever you ten or more one, two, three, four, five. I hate that I have to count my opponent's permanents. Can they just tell me somewhere how many permanents they have? Wow, that's lazy, bro. You're lazy. They have six currently. I'm tempted to shoot this guy, but I don't think I care enough to do it. Kill that. Kill that jabron. I mean, we could have not attacked, and then they don't get a 2-2, two -two, but... That seems worse. Like, I'd rather attack and get, give them one counter than not attack and give them no counters. Also, if we get that land. Oh, we already have the land. Um, never mind. I'm good. I'm good. Um, I guess we just kill... We gotta kill this guy, right? Maybe we don't have to. Don't have that dino that one one trick, bro. They did not have the one one trick, bro. It's like they gained no life at all. I'm not gonna run this guy into this guy because that seems bad. I will, however, be able to reckless rage during their turn and shoot both of our bros. Be like shoot, shoot, and then you take another two. God, they're basically dead. I'm gonna put it up here so you can see see these tiny dinosaurs. See him just fine. Are tiny dinosaurs called dinosaurs? Because that seems better. Why? Why wouldn't it? Why would it? Because they're tiny. Go on. Oh, this is so good. Whoo, that was a good deal, him, dude. Boys. That's a two for one. Oh, Punk Apostle 34. Thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the Soul Tie Brood. You are awesome. Land? Hold me oh, close boy. So we got a six drop and an eight drop. Do we just play this guy? I guess. What are you going to do? Not play him? Yeah, I guess we can play him and then hit a land. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And not, not a land, but I mean, hit a guy that we can play, rather. Not, not. Oh, I try to like you, but I don't because you're not a good person. Oh, I like this guy. The 4-4 four four that makes a dude every time. Or ra Oh, it's Raging Reggie, right? Old Raging Reggie. It's one of the 4-4s, four right? Yeah. It could also be Hammer Skull. Hammer Skull seems good. I do like a Hammer Skull. It could just be this, the flyer, too, and then we just attack for six in the air every turn. Also seems good. The point is we have a lot of options. I'm going to take the, the Helio... The Slobity dops. What? I think you heard me, and I don't think we should fight about it. Oh, that's real mature. You're like a you're like a child. Oh, I like this guy because now when I play a dinosaur, this guy gets you just take two every time I play a dinosaur. Now it's not bad. Uh, you, what does it say? Deal one damage to each creature. Yeah, that's totally fine. I think we trade, right? No, I don't think so. We have too much enrage going on. I have too much enrage. Oh, 
Oh, a little Nesty would die to this guy. We gotta say no. We gotta veto. Veto little Nesties. Thank thankfully this is a May ability. Otherwise old Nesty would, would take a hit. Old Nesty. <laughs> That's old Nest Daddy. Only he's a little baby. Stealing eggs is probably one of the worst professions you can have, right? Is that a profession? Uh, in my professional opinion, it is. What profession are you from? Egg stealing. Oh, so you're an egg stealer, eh? I don't, don't want to talk about it. I just told you it's the worst profession you can have. Why would you make me talk about it? <laughs> you old egg napper. What are you willing to sacrifice? Some oh, that was a good draw. I feel like we do shoot here almost just so we can get an extra two in yeah they'd be like nothing they'd be dead basically i mean we kill our own nest raptor but being able to deal two every turn whenever we play a dinosaur is pretty strong so they are basically dead i'll judge all the egg nappers would you really are you going to be their judge jury and their egg executioner Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, heavens, no. I'll take one land so I can just play this guy. So give me just a six land, that's all. All right, that ain't it, but... It'll do. Will it? Yes. Will it do? That's from... You know what it's from. <laughs> it's from good... You, you know, you know. You know. It's a good Mythical Morning reference, brah. I got tar look at me targeting all these things. This guy gets this. This guy gets this. Squawk. Old cutie here to win the game. <laughs> hey, guys. Just being a little cutie. All right. You do your thing. You put him at a one here. Yeah, I know. I hate doing it because I just lose my little hatchy, but... God, do I do it? I think so. I'm just throwing... I guess it's a shock, right? I just I just cast a shock. Choose target opponent. There's only one. They should have got rid of our guy, man. It's been dealing so much damage. I mean, they didn't really it's have a way to do that, day. though, right? Like, it's <laughs> not like... <laughs> That's good. I like your dinosaur spit. Remember that time that dinosaur handler on... on that supervisor on Jurassic Park messed up? <laughs> and you were like, hey, man. There were dinosaurs all up in the kitchen. We won the game. Oh, that guy would have come down. Thanks to old. Yeah, this card was surprisingly good that match. In conjunction with this guy who, uh, or this guy. I wonder if this is better than Nest Robber. Nah. Really? Nah. Really? I don't know. Okay. This might be good. We saw a lot of things that can kill. Yeah, we did actually. I don't like Nestor because it just dies to our death or to our uh, this guy. But they did have two two twos on board when we won the game, so I'm just gonna bring that guy. We don't have a lot of five drops either, so. Anytime was on sir. <laughs> Remember when Newman worked at Jurassic Park? I do. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I understood that reference. Oh, that's good. That's good. I actually like this hand, even though it doesn't have a lot of action. Our opponent's deck doesn't seem that aggressive, and we are uh, winning the game, so it doesn't really matter. I'm actually going to play planes here. No, I can, uh, yeah, we're going to play planes in case we draw the 3 3. Make me feel some type of whip. And then we can play it off the unclaimed territory, otherwise, we'll just play a forest. I wish we had a two drop, though, to take advantage of this New Horizons. But I guess we can just play Sword Tooth on three. Which, oh, and then play another land? Oof. That's it's like he was designed for that or something. That's pretty good. That's P good, as the kitties would say. As the, little, the, say as the little children would say, yeah. Chitlins. Little less, con little less conversation, a little more action. That's a good jam. What was that, Elvis? Little more bark, a little less bite. A little less bark, a little more bite, I bet. I bet it's, I bet it's the other way. 
I've been some type of way. Man, you're going to do it, man. I'm going to say dinosaur. Oh, you can name anything, huh? Yeah, that's why I said it's cavernous souls, bro. Dinosaur spell. Dinosaur spell. Tap that mana. Dinosaur spell. I was like, what, you got a spell pierce here? You think in the next set they're going to reprint Grow Ultimatum and call it Dinosaur Ultimatum? Oh my god, that would be amazing. <laughs> it does the same thing, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> it's, the same, it's, a, it's, a, it's a functional reprint. Same card, it's just... But they just put Dinosaur on it so it would be in the theme. Yeah, and I, I, I can get behind that. Oh, now you're going to do this You're gonna do this nonsense here. Okay. 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 He's got a little Bane Slayer Angel. He definitely, they definitely have a little Bane Slayer Angel. I have a little Hunt the Week Angel. Hunt the Wangel, if you will. So I go one, two, three, I'd have one, two. Hunt the Wangel. I'm just going to play both my lands now. One, two, three, four, five. So we play one, two, three with New Horizons. We have one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. I think it's actually just this guy right now. As much as I would like to just get rid of this dude. So this makes two. So if we go one, two, three, put it here, we'd have one, two, three. We're one shy. All right. Some type of way. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. We also have eight perms, so next turn we can play this guy. We need one more permanent in general to be able to get the city's blessing. Is the city's blessing a permanent? It's got to be like a like a token, like the monarch token, right, from Conspiracy. Oh, yeah. yeah, there it is. Look at it. Look, look at it. Look, there it is. There it is, boyos. That is a permanent. So now we can actually go one, two, three. Put you. I'm going to say oh, you're on here. Yeah, that's correct. And put your little counter on here, I guess. And then we can actually hunt the week on probably this this Birdman. And then it act, that actually also turns on our, our blessing. Some type of blessing. And we get a guy. There's the guy that will turn on our city's blessing, I imagine. Did it. Now we can attack. And if you want to trade these three cards for my wayward sword tooth, I am... I'm all right about Carry it. Carry on my wayward sword tongue. Wow, sword tongue. It's his name, right? Um, no. Once you have ascended to the highest temple of Arazka, the power of the immortal sun is yours to wield for a couple days. <laughs> <laughs> it's much less. It's much less exciting if it says that, right? Like, wow, only yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, for like for an hour or two. <laughs> it's like they specify the time. Uh, you know, for about uh, 16 minutes. Wow, this is getting less and less. I don't want any lands anymore. You understand? You understand? I don't want any lands. I'm just going to bring this guy in. If they want to double block, that's fine. If they bring this guy in, they can block with their 2-3 and their 3-3. And it's a, a one, for, 1 for 2, I guess. But they're not two good cards. So I don't care. I don't care. What'd I say? You're so reckless. I know. This Legion's judgment's uh it's not really it's not really earning its keep here. It's not judging anybody. You didn't you haven't you've never judged anything, you stupid idiot. I mean I guess it's good that he has nothing with four more power. <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Like I think it's like, oh well, I guess if I can't use this, I'm in good shape. Ryo. I feel like you're exploding over there. Are you okay? No. Reggie! It's little Reggie! It's big Reggie. Oh, big Reg? What up, big Reg? All right, let's put them in. Why do you call them permanents? If they get removed, they're more like temporary. That's true. That's a true story. What's the deal with permanents? Am I right? If they get removed, aren't they like temporaries? That was good. That was a Jerry Seinfeld. Thank you. <laughs> All right. 
I had no idea. Look at this. Look at this. Like three for one. I guess it's yeah. It's still three for one. It's this guy, this and this. Even though this was made by this, so it's only three. But that's still a good amount. Also get a dude out of it. Yeah. Unless they got a trick. Oh god, they have a trick, don't they? Oh my god, the blowout is gonna be so real. Here we go. What? All right. So I, all right, that was a weird choice, but. Did you expect me to, like, save it? I guess you could have. I mean, there's nothing wrong with what you did. I'm just like, oh, stupid. You did, you, you, you. And that's not a real thing to do. Reggie, it's your grandma. I don't like how you're beating up those other dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, boy. It's, oh, it sounded like Hank Hill. It's like, hey, what's the deal with... What was it? I forgot what we were talking about. What's the deal with propane tanks? <laughs> hey, why do they go, go what, God damn it, why do they call them permanents if when they're removed they're temporaries? That sure makes me feel some type of way. Permanents and permanent Butter accessories. Butter free. B -b -b Butter free. Oh, that was a good dr 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 draw. So if we we're gonna shoot this guy immediately, then you have a three three and a two two. I guess we just you don't have any flyers, so I'm just gonna hunt here. Eh, kill this big dude. Makes me feel some type of way. I think we're in good shape. You can't block our floater. You did gain a little bit of loof. Loof. Hey, you should gain a little bit of loof, huh? Move into our other sapling. Oh, yeah, he killed it. Yeah, he was like, JK, JK. And then they we didn't actually get to... Uh... Oh, you get a 1-1 one, one if that guy dies? That card's real good. 2-1 for 1, that gives you 1-1? One, one? Okay. That makes me feel some type of way, at least. Are you going to quad block this guy and gain 4? Oh, you are? Oh, boy. Reggie, no! Somebody touch my spaghetti! <laughs> oh, boy. Didn't work. Oh, I know why. I I'm moved it. Somebody touch my spaghetti! I couldn't hear it still, but... No, neither could I. It might just be too low. My speakers might be too low. <laughs> so good. Oh. Oh, he can't... Now he can't do his thing? Man, that's just a dinosaur trying to get a... Get a... Apparently they heard Get a it, nut. So. We're good to go. Yeah, I know they heard it. That's how it worked last time, too, so. Can you not mess up my life? Never. You'd never not mess up my life? Mm-hmm. Oh, Fatal Roundhouse! Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it, buddy. You are awesome. How do you still have City's Blessing? Because you get it for the rest of the game. Oh. All right, well, that just wins us the game, right? Four, five, no, I guess not yet. But almost. But in the future. Can Carry some type on of way? my barbably boo. I'm going to pass here and assume you can't deal an extra seven to me. Does that feel safe? This is a real still had all these moment. Somebody touch him in some type of way. <laughs> Somebody, what you got two of these? Oh, no, that's a I oh, that was the last game. Okay, I was like, My god, it's not that good, right? But it's two of this, it's two. Well, it's a two, it's a two mana one one that will get bigger every time you get damage. So, yeah, it's not that good. I think it's pretty good. It's all right. I think somebody touching my spaghetti, somebody touching my spaghetti. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's just get in with both, because if you want to block my sappy, you're welcome to do so. 
And they would die. Oh, they like dying. Cool. Well, they're going to die anyway because this guy's float, so. Oh. I just wanted to, like, I'm like, all right, you're going to take that damage anyway, so. Yeah, look, we're 2 up. It's pretty good. Somebody touch my spaghetti. I'm going to do it again. Somebody touch my spaghetti. It's weird that I can't hear that one, but I can hear the other ones. I don't understand. I can hear it in my mind. Same. Oh, yeah, same. Hey, man, did you update the Discord? What do you mean, update it? You let the, let the people know? No. Oh, look. Oh, boy. We did it. Definitely keep. Oh, yeah, this is real good. And we got a nest robber, too. Is spaghetti a metaphor? It's a metaphor for spaghetti. <laughs> you know how you do. You don't know about spaghetti? No. That's sad. Do you know about some type of way? No. I don't believe you. I think you know about all these memes. No. Okay. <laughs> I love how obsessed Frank is with that meme. He's made it grow on me. Well, if I could... That's my contribution to the universe, I guess. I'm glad I could help. Someone's got to do it. Is Mama in the kitchen with spaghetti? I mean, she's in the kitchen with onions, so... That's, They're uh, often onions and spaghetti. Did they reveal a pirate? Oh, they did. They revealed a prosperous pirate. How? Oh, God. And you're going to equip Super that dude? Aggro. And they didn't attack. I'm intrigued. So now I can just... Oh, I can't Savage Stomp yet, though. I can't Why do not? any of these things because this is a 4-3. That's a big That's a big boy. I mean, you could still do it. It just wouldn't be that great. I mean, we're just going to attack because we have to, so... We actually don't have to. No, it has to attack each turn or block. Oh. That's literally its only job. You understand? Well, its job is to die, apparently. Well, that is sad, but that's life, my man. I wish it said plus two, plus two. Dang. Sarah, happy birthday. I didn't know it was your birthday, buddy. Man. Oh, wow. Where were you last turn? If we drew this last turn, we just kill this guy, and it's just a, an utter blowout. An utter blow? Somebody once touched my spaghetti. Somebody once touched my spaghetti. I said, hey, don't touch my spaghetti. <laughs> Need help. <I> know. <laughs> Sarah, three months up. Thank you so much, buddy. You are awesome. Ah, uh, you're the best. I'm going to take this raging Reggie. That's old. Regerino. A little Parmesan uh, Reggiano. Delicious. Okay. <laughs> That's wonderful. This is my favorite. I'm I'm your dad. It's my favorite. I'm your favorite dad. False. How dare you? How dare you? How well, dare maybe you? if you wouldn't touch on my spaghetti. Maybe if your spaghetti wasn't so delicious. Well, how else am I going to make it? Well, you can make it terribly. Sarah, have a good night, buddy. Thank you so much for uh, stopping in to, to insist on a happy birthday. Don't eat any Tide Pods, even though it's your birthday. What did you just say? I said don't eat any Tide Pods. I'll tell her what to do. You're not her spaghetti dad. <laughs> What's a spaghetti dad? <laughs> you know what it is. I don't actually. I you no know idea. what it is. Not even a little bit. I'm going to do this iDubs meme just to make sure the, the, the sound on that one's working. Hey, that's pretty good. How come I can hear that, but I can't hear the other one? Mm, better stop it, man. Intriguing. That's an MP4. That's an MP4, too. Weird. You, got, you coming at me with that, dude? All right. We get to bombard and stomp this turn. That's pretty insane. They're basically dead. What does it say? When it has double strike as long as you have the city's blessing, and these are just so these are just two two dummies. What's going on? Why can't I? I'm in my upkeep still. Wow, that was amazing. I didn't even care about drawing a card. <laughs> I said, man, I don't know, but I'm a dude. 
I'll have a little change. Sarah, I appreciate that you're a sub for however many months. Three months. And uh, you're like, yeah, I love stopping by, disrupting the stream, then peacing out for five minutes. Like, that is that is wonderful that you can still be a sub under those conditions. I accept. Our deck seems real good. Am I just, am I just like... Also, you this... You lost yet. This card seems pretty good against them. Like, every one of their dudes is like a 2-1, right? Yeah. I'm going to bring that in. I'm going to take Nesty out. Wasn't there another 2-1 that we had in our deck that I was like, eh? I don't think so. No? Oh, this little Hatchy? I think Hatchy's probably fine, though. Oh, that's a little Hatchy! <laughs> Oh, you guys are amazing. You guys make me feel some type of way. This is, oh, the double way tooth, the wayward sword tooth hand. That's pretty good. I guess we got a planes here. And then we go this into this. And then we just hope to draw our three, three, three for, for two and play it on turn two. Three, two, that costs three on turn three. Okay, sure. You don't have to play on turn three. Well, yeah, but they're probably going to. You don't know that. You don't know anything. <sighs> Maybe you're right. Oh, wow. <clears throat> it's just, just draw a card? That's ridiculous. You're going to draw two extra cards from that guy? That's uncomfortable. Yep. And it gets plus one, plus one? Good lord. I mean, it does have to be sacrificed if you can't get through with it, so. Well, the dinosaurs stop coming and they don't stop coming. Back to the rules and I hit the ground running, but it didn't make sense not to live for fun. You play a Roomba and Crag and then you bombard this one. Alright, well. So this is a two for one, but they drew two cards, so they're still up one card. Who's counting? A subscriber to get girtherism? I don't even know what that is. So the answer is no. Sounds like a terrible disease. Yeah, I'm sorry. I heard about your uncle and his girtherism. Oh, just a three mana two two that draws you a card. Okay. They've drawn every card draws another card. I'm not comfortable with any of this. It's pretty good. It's a uh, pretty good uh, some type of way. Next up, we can go sword tooth and sword tooth. That's pretty good. You get a sword tooth, and you get a sword tooth. They really need to make it easier to sub for mobile. I agree. As someone who appreciates ever each and every sub, I agree with you. What is going on, dude? We're dying. Yeah, this game's over. This this was this was an aggressive start. Dot deck over here. There were not as many X ones as I thought. We're I'm gonna take out islands. No wonder we lost. My goodness. I guess I just bring that dude in. Actually, maybe I don't hate this guy. Just as an O three blocker that becomes a three three. I don't know. I don't know. I'm okay, Day. What's a pirate's favorite color? Is it C? No, that's the letter. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Is it C? Oh, it's not a Oh, that was color. the other jokes. Oh, God, I hate myself. Is it red? That was terrible. That doesn't... Yeah, that doesn't... Orange? Is it R? C red. Oh, my God. That's not even... That doesn't even make sense. That's not even a color. C red, purple. I got Armageddon twice in one game of Plane Chase EDH. That is not okay. How is it purple? I would have said orange. Orange. Oh, uh, yeah, that'll do. Some type of way. Your aura is purple. Who knows what that's from? I do. Do you really? Yeah, it's Jurassic Park, right? <laughs> Was that right? 
No, but I mean that was the I, I I appreciate. Wow, every game you've had this on turn one, dude. Must be nice, as What's the kids say. From? It's from uh, Almost Famous, the Cameron Crowe movie. Oh, I've never seen that. You've never seen Almost Famous? It's real no. good. Make well, to my list of movies that I'll with. say I'll watch but never will. Wow, that's messed up, man. <laughs> it's a really long list. Some type of list. I wonder if I should have bombarded this turn and then next turn played this guy in Savage Stomp. But I don't have a land that comes into play on tap, so I don't know if that's an option. What if I put New Horizons on the Evolving Wilds so I can use it? That's actually pretty sweet. I guess you could do that. Yeah, why couldn't I? I don't know why you would, but you could do that. What's I mean, it's going to produce two mana either way, right? Yeah, but why? Why, why not, though? But why? I don't know what you're saying. You can right thin a land out of your deck, though. Right, but I get to use it next turn. Is my thing. I can play New Horizons, put a counter on this guy, and then Savage Stomp in oh. the same turn. Okay. Like I know you're gonna, I got a trick here. Great, great. So much for that. Yeah, I mean, what are you gonna do? I could wait till next turn to bombard, but now we have nothing, which is real sad. It is pretty sad. Somebody did touch on my spaghetti. I saw it. I watched it happen. Somebody, I like your server view, but I think they needed a help, a help, a heaping sir. Mike doesn't know how to read the cards, so it makes it more difficult. Yeah, to... I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> it was funny because of just how, how how like forward you were about. Yeah, yeah, I can't read. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can play this guy and stomp somebody. But we can't also bombard them. Could just play 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, it's not terrible unless they like hijack it and kill us. And before that happens. I added one with this instead of two. Man, you're such a I'll use green because I have to. There we go. We did it. It was a long road. It was we got a, there. I had faith. It was real touch and go for a little bit there. Mike, I bet you know the... Actually, you probably know the new visit flavor text, don't you? The one with all the math on it? Yeah. Yeah. That's because Michael is a mathematician, not a not a word guy. Not a english matician. <laughs> a mitch matician. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what that does. Uh, if I figure out the creature like turn. Oh, equation. cool. You just bounced my guy. Wow, that is utterly miserable. Your deck is fantastic. Not anymore. You can never have this. You can never have this. Making you feel some type of way. Are you a math doer? I might be. Mitch, I might be. You see what I did there? No. Yes, you did. I can't see either. Wow, you don't even have eyes? I have well, that, eyes. Maybe that contributes to why you can't read. I have eyes. I just can't see. That makes me feel some type of way, dude. Make it, give me like a Reggie or something. Oh, that's actually... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that's either... It's, I can play both of these guys or just this guy. Ugh. I think I just got to play these two. That just makes me feel some type of way, though. I really just want to attack, but I'm at four, so... It's not looking great. You can never have this. Surprised you got that far into the countdown with no one interrupting. That was good. That was impressive. All right, so you just paid full cost for that guy, which is good for us. Oh, no taxis. 
What happened? What did I miss? <laughs> Some type of way. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Huh? This is probably just better at this juncture, right? Let's play it correctly. Three, four, five. Cast him. Come on. Let's go. Do the thing. They have one card in hand. Do we risk attacking with 7-7? Seven, seven? Yes, we have to. We don't have to, actually. We have to, Mitchell. You say this vintage cube look, deck looks bad, but we're, we're, we're winning, so. Are we? Hashtag winning, Mitchell. This is 14 damage, so they have to block something. At least one thing. If they block this guy, they take 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and die. So they have to block more than one thing. So actually, this is like the perfect situation for us. Make you feel some type of way. That's what happens when it switches from the holiday cube to the rest of the day cube. Yeah, this is just the rest of the day cube. This is this is the old Wednesday cube. Not as exciting. Look at all my dinosaurs. Rompin' stompin' dinosaur. It's a dinosaur. Remember that Chef Boyardee commercial? No. Oh, uh, they. I think they did have something with Ascend. They had... Uh, did they not? Yeah, this guy. They had Stormfleet Swashbuckler. With ascend. Four, five, six, seven. Yep, that was a good block, a good one. I play Reggie, and then I die. No, this guy's dead. Okay, cool. And then I die. Cool. I actually like. I was like, wait, did you figure out a block that I just missed? So, and then I was like, no, that guy has to die. He has to die. If he has to die, he has to die. Oh my god, here we go. Fireball. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. I don't think that's... I mean, like, you have you have one land and one card to play. Wow, that's card's Actually, insane, though. they might be dead. I'm sure they're dead. You sure? They, they get to play one land. No, actually, was that the... Did they play a land? No. So they get one land, and then they have to play something that costs one mana if they have it. Otherwise, they're dead. Hey, look at, look at us. We're crushing our first Rivals of Ixalan draft. To be fair, I'm not sure all of our decks are going to look like this. This deck feels pretty good. Hey, that deck's pretty good. Alan, did you change your color? How did you go from... I don't understand. You went from blue... How did you go from green to red? What's happening right now? Thanks for that. Just a little, little howdy doody meme. Wait, what? Where? That that comment from the YouTube. Oh, it was probably because we took Soul Ring. In the okay. <laughs> why are you like this? The answer is no one knows why Michael was like this. It was just part of his programming. He wasn't loved very much as a child, and he became forever damaged because of it. Swear on me, mum. Please open Chup for me. I don't know what that means. I have no idea what that means. Old Chup. Oh, I drafted a bunch. I had a foil Tetzimok, a foil Atali, and a non-foil. Look at these words you're saying. Please open Chup for me. And his name is Chup, not safe for work. I don't. I, am I opening you? That doesn't sound. That doesn't sound safe for work. You're right. Oh, Chupacabra. Okay, that's a good one. Um, God, I really want this dinosaur, but I don't think we're gonna hit a red on. Like, the card after the dinosaur would have to be a, a mountain. Oh, the old card after the dinosaur. It wasn't. Capture those dinosaurs. I guess That's I should have. Hmm? A two drop. Yeah, that ain't bad. It's uh, pretty good. Oh, God. If I could just draw lands from here on out, I would actually be fine with that. Go three drop, four drop, 
Five drop, six drop, hunt the weak. Oh, wow. It's murder. That was aggressive. I feel like at this point, Mike can't talk to himself without also hearing an inner Frank voice. Maybe that's true. Okay. <laughs> Some type of okay? It's funny, because that was like a... Nothing like playing that guy and then not having to land a play. Right. Yeah, it's real bad. Unlike... It's no Courser of Crew Fix, that's for sure. Look at this weird deck they're playing. What's weird about this it? This guy's not legendary, right? All right, cool. Once I draw two lands Even at, more at the same exact time... Even more impressive is playing another one of those guys and still not having a land. I get it, man. You don't have to rub it in my face. God. Yeah, I do. My opponent's like, yeah, cool cool dinosaurs, bro. Oh, that's actually fine, I guess. I'm just going to play it now. In case you have a combat trick, then we don't get to deal that. We don't want to take the damage from it. Imagine if those are just three mana five fives that can attack and play an extra land. Yeah, without, so it just doesn't have a set. Oh, God. No setback. Man, I liked it better when I drew lands from my deck. I think we're dead. Six, seven, eight. Well, we can block one of these guys. It's not looking good though. Let's let's be real. I guess if we I guess we can hunt the weak this guy and just kill it next turn. Block here, pick off this guy. Oh no, he's got hexproof. Dang it. Will you nickname a card Lil Dumplin'? Um <laughs> Oh, crying out loud. That's a funny question. Um, I don't know is the answer to that. Because, what even? I guess we go to three here. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Make me feel some kind of eight. I guess we can trade with the dinosaur. It don't feel good though. It don't feel good, no. This no. is what's known as a two for one, where you get. Uh, you you expend two cards and your opponent doesn't expend any because they had a pump spell. And then we go to the next game and feel bad about our life choices. You should wow ha ha you when he tricked you? No, I thought that too, but I think it was when we played the second uh, Sword Tooth. Yeah. <laughs> like they're, uh, they take time to get moving. They're a little slow in the morning. Just like me. Yeah, ain't that the truth. Oh my god, dude. I'm just bringing this guy again. Stormfleet Pyromancer seems fine. And we'll take out... Stop taking out Little Dumpling. I... <laughs> oh no, it happened! Oh, Legion Judgment seems good here. I'll keep that guy in. Um... Are we ever Ooh. casting Zepalopadopadop? It doesn't actually feel like it, but I feel like if we do, we just win the game. So I'm going to keep him in there anyway. I almost feel like we want an 18th land in this deck, but I don't think so. Slice and Twain is in this format? Huh. Yeah, we got Slice and Twain, Naturalize, and Shatter. So if you got any artifacts or enchantments, they're all dead. I think we keep this. Ugh, it's kind of rough, though. Is that all the colors? Yeah, well, so does Pocahontas. And you paint with there all the go. colors of my Mitch. No. No, I'm just going to say no. The answer is no. Definitely not. God, winning the game does work pretty well. I wish I could have done that. If I was a better player, I would have won the game. Make me win some type of way. No. Shut up. Shut up. You're wasting your time. The more you ignore me, the closer I'll get. Wow, how'd you pull that You're one You're wasting your time. Uh, because that's a lyric in the song? I just said it, though. This is yeah. super random. That wasn't random. It's literally a lyric in the song. How I, can't, I don't know how, I don't yeah, know how else to say like, it to you. What if I was just saying that, you know? Uh, you could have. Oh, look. What the fuck is the grill? What WTF is this grill do? Yeah, cool. God, why are these? I don't understand. Why, why? do they keep misspelling it? I, don't, I, don't, I think why? it's... Why? Why even make that? I don't even understand it. Like, what's the point? Uh, 
Uh, for those who don't know, I, I read a story once about a fan who went up to Bruce Campbell and was like, hey, you're Bruce Campbell. I'm a huge fan. And he was like, somebody, or like they went, hey, are you Bruce Campbell? I'm a huge fan. It was one of those two. And he's like, somebody's got to be. And then he just walked away. And I was like, wow, that's, that's a hilarious response. It also seems like a very Bruce Campbell thing to do. Yeah. <laughs> Like, uh, I watched that new show. Is that still on? I saw the first season and it was good. I liked it. All right. It's called, what is it called? I think I have. Good. It's called, uh, it's called, I think it's called Ash vs. Evil Dead, actually. Ash vs. Evil Dead, yeah. Yeah. Some type of way. Oh, that was a good draw. Especially because our opponents missed the land drop. Not wasting your time. Not, I'm never blocking that dude in a million years without man up. Oh, yeah. Well, you decided anyway, so that's fine. That's just fine. Cool. You doing okay, man? No. The more you ignore me, the bigger Mitch you'll be. If you stand on a scale in some type of way. <laughs> God, my chat, you guys are amazing. I just want to, I want to just want to marry every, everybody in the chat right now. It's huge, huge. We're all doing it, guys. It's a big ceremony. Hey, man. Let me see that Bronto Don. It's your Bronto boy. I guess we're giving our boy float here. Go to your face. Goat your face? Yeah, makes you feel some type of goat face. That doesn't make any sense. It wasn't my it wasn't my best work, guys. I'm sorry. You guys should replace your hand with the bones. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I, I have no problem with that. That seems like a solid idea. Uh, what could possibly go wrong is my response. And uh, I can cut off your hand for you, free of charge. God, your friendship is just. Is I'll this guy just? Knife. Is this guy just better in our deck as like a blocker that blocks everything? Man, I don't like that guy. Okay, why though? Because he's just a stupid forty that dies to everything. Yeah, but all their guys like we want early guys. Um, and they also have a million like if they have a four four like they just did, it just Dude, kills it. We just won. We can't even lose. I'm just going to take Big Idiot out because we haven't had eight mana once in, the, in these matches. I think we have. First game. Okay. <laughs> well, I just... That feels worse. This hand is great, though. Yeah, it seems like keep. We got this two drop, this little cutie. That makes me feel some type of way. I'll tell you what. I, boy, I'll tell you what. <laughs> they get you with that hand kill there? No, no, no. Oh, is it chat Chad, thing? Yeah. <laughs> Why do we have so many grandmas in our chat? Kisses from grandma. What's this guy? What's he gonna do? Alright, see you later, trash can man. This is my cherished hatchling. Don't you dare touch him. Don't you touch him! Oh, they didn't get in there. That's sad. I wanted to get. That I wanted to also get in. <laughs> Cherished hatchling and little. Wait, which one's a little dumpling? This one. Yeah. Oh, I thought I, we could. We, why can't we, this guy be dumpling? Because he spits at you. He's not a dumpling. Oh, that's real sad. Oh, that's. Oh, look at our hand. Our hand's real good, right? Sure. Next time we can bombard and stomp. The more you ignore me, the closer I get. Stop being a Mitch. In the pan. In the hole. That guy died? Wow, that's so sad. Whether you do or not. That's a good that's a good one. You're a little dumpling. The closer I get. You little Man, dumpling. The song gets stuck in your head so easily. <laughs> don't judge me. I don't need your song judgment. You're getting it anyway. It's going to be the one game where we get to 8 mana. That makes me feel some type of way. 
Next time we can hunt and stomp, depending on what they do. Like, that's a lot of... That's a lot of shooties. You, you know what I'm saying? Alright, here comes 6-6 that we can't deal with. It's like the one thing. Oh. Oh my god. Well, we have ways to kill that. I mean... Kind of. We have some type of ways. Huh. <laughs> I feel like we just trade here. I hate doing it, but... One, two, three... That's a real pain in the butt, though. Mm -hmm. Makes me feel some type of way. Guess they still take two. Make me feel some type of way. It's putting Gaunt in your deck in a mission that on average your opponent's deck is better than yours. That's actually hilarious. Um, I would say it's an admission that your opponent's deck is equally as good as yours. Hey, it's free card, right? Free cards are free cards. Oh my god, really? Really? Rude. That's amazing. Can I get a big dude? That's literally the smallest dude ever. him out. Well, we couldn't cast that guy anyway. I'm talking about just like a six drop or a five drop here. Give me that guy that gives float and then we just win the game. Can you make me feel some type of way? Is this real? In pretty good draws. Wow, I feel like we were in amazing position, and then they played rare and two two bomb uncommons. Whoo! All right. Woo, indeed. You just alpha here. Why do you why do you care about this guy? It's the, it's the same thing. It's all the same creature. Yep. Now we draw land. Okay. I guess that's the end. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we literally have to fight this guy. And then there's, there's like no way to win because they have nine power on board. All right. Well, that's unfortunate. <sighs> that's really stupid. This is and then, okay. So this is the exact moment. Uh, that happens in regular drafts. That is not happening in like cube drafts, for example. Where, sure. Um, yeah, and then you just kill us. Nope, not yet. Okay. Where you are in a position where nothing you draw in your deck is strong enough to, to beat what your opponent has on board. Like, why? Wait, what? <laughs> That's weird. Worried about some kind of... Some kind of way? Haste guy, I guess. That's weird. You already have a blocker, though. What can I even do? There's no one card in this format. Yeah, so like we draw two lands. Um, and it's a situation where like our opponent has... Uh, y y the average card quality of the cube is so that it's fair for both players. Uh, if they have a big thing, you could also have a big thing and respond to their big thing. Um, whereas like in, in drafts, like regular drafts, like regular pack drafts, if your opponent opens Registar Alpha, Raging Swordtooth, and like this guy, and then just plays them back to back to back... And that's not to say we didn't. Our deck was great. But if they do that, uh, you are going to be so far behind, there is no card in your deck that can actually get you back into the game. Whereas in the cube, you can draw like Damnation, Wrath of God, Day of Judgment, Nevin Rolls Disc, like um, a million different cards. So at any point in the game, you feel like you have a way to come back from most any situation. Whether you draw it or not, that's one thing, but you have the potential to do it. 
And this is the frustrating part about games like this, because three turns ago, I realized I was dead. There's no card in my deck that gets me back from 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 4 4. <laughs> like, you just can't. There's It's just not happening. So, um, you get to a point in these games where you have to, you're just, I'm just dead. And then you just have to accept that for the next four turns, because maybe you'll draw something, but you won't. So, all right. 2 1. Still not terrible, I guess, but uh, not ideal for our for our deck, I think. So, best. we'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to slam those like and subscribe buttons. And, uh, See you next time again, I guess.